Hi, if you're on this site, you're probably a Fort Hayes student thinking about studying abroad. You might be pretty scared about the possibility of it since it's a huge change in your life, but we're here to tell you as former and current ex uh, study abroad students uh, why is, it's worth it and why um, the fear should not hold you back from experiencing this really great opportunity. So my name is Meredith. Um, I am a student here at Fort Hayes who uh, studied abroad in Bulgaria through International Student Exchange Program. And here with me, I have my friend Mai, and I'll let her introduce herself. Hi, I'm Mai. I'm from Japan. I'm an exchange student here at Fort Hayes. Yeah. Uh, so, like I said, we're here to kind of calm your fears. If you're thinking about studying abroad, but maybe uh, just the thought of it is really scary. Um, but like, like we said, we've both been we both been there because before I went, I was scared, and same with Mai. She was scared before she came over here to America. Um, so first I'll give it over to Mai and she's going to uh, kind of talk about her experience and uh, how she kind of overcame some of the fears that she had. Okay, so before I left Japan, my friend who had been studying abroad before told me that not everything is easy and fun, but you, will, you won't regret studying abroad. This... this um, this word uh, gave me a college to go to study abroad. And the very first months here, it was really challenging for me because everything is new, the environment, people, and everything, it changed. And here also, there's not so many people are familiar with my culture, like Japanese culture. So I thought I will be alone but I think it was a good way to get out of my comfort zone and this fear turned to my um, turned to be a very good thing to spend here yeah. great yeah uh, so now I'll give you a little bit of my advice that I would give to someone who's thinking about studying abroad but might be a little bit scared uh, so first of all, I think it's important to remember that you're probably never going to comple completely get over your fear before you leave. Uh, it, would, it won't be until you actually get to wherever you're going uh, when you realize what an amazing opportunity it is, um, and you'll begin to be glad that you chose to go. Um, but for the time up to that, um, I have some advice to kind of help you calm your fears. Uh, so first, I would advise you to just focus on what you're excited about and why you chose to go abroad or why you're thinking about going abroad. This could be that you're excited to get away from your normal everyday life for a while or maybe you're really excited to finally get to your destination because it's somewhere you've always wanted to go. Uh, or maybe it's you're just excited to make lots of new friends and, um, and meet new people. So instead of focusing on how scared you might be or what you're worried about or what you're scared is going to happen, I would suggest just focusing on what you have to look forward to. Uh, second, I would suggest to start researching the country that you want to go to or that you are going to um, and learn as many things as you can about it. Um, this kind of goes hand in hand with getting excited about your experience because knowing more about where you're going will make you want to just be there already. Uh, you can begin making plans of, on what you want to see and what you want to do while you're there. And then before long, you'll begin to feel more excited about studying abroad than fearful. Um, third, uh, I would suggest talking to other students like us who have studied abroad. Uh, ask them how they overcame their fears and tell them what you're fearful of. You may find that they had the same fears as you and it ended up not being as scary for them as they thought. Uh, once they got there. Um, and lastly, uh, that, that ties into my last piece of advice for you. I would suggest um, just understanding that anything that you're fearful of, you can't really control right now at this point. Um, whether maybe you're scared of like, you now you're not getting along with your roommate, but you can't really control that because you're not there and you can't choose your roommate. It's just all up to fate and what ends up happening. <laughs> um, yeah. So you might as well spend, not spend too much time thinking about it. Um, instead, get excited and trust that everything will be okay. And as Maya said, you won't regret your study abroad experience. And anything that may go wrong will just all be part of the adventure. So that's about all the advice we have for you. Um, but 
I really hope you won't let your fears hold you back from experiencing this really, really great experience that we have both experienced firsthand. Um, it's a great opportunity to take advantage of while you're in college. And um, yeah, I hope, I hope you consider it. <laughs> All right. Bye. Bye.